X. Example 1, Chapter 5, Fluid Mechanics. A copy board is a water cross dusting approximately 1 mm in diameter. We want to know the drag force on the copy board when it moves slowly in fresh water, which the fresh water specification provided here. A scale model 100 times larger is made and tested in glycerin at B4. We have a model information 100 times greater and the velocity is 30 cm on second. The drag force measured 1.3 newtons and we have the specific for glycerin as and the viscosity equals to the 1.5 kg on m so in this case, we have Reynolds numbers as dimensionless number for the similarity. We have rho with L on mu relation for Reynolds number. In this case, we should make an equality between model, in this case, M, T and the prototype vm vp and dp on mu p the density and viscosity of each fluid are available there is also information about the diameter of the coupe code and 100 times greater a model so we can replace the data as these quantities the density multiplied the velocity is met on second and the diameter of model is the the diameter of copper pod is 1 mm for, for prototype. For model, we can obtain multiply to 100, which be 1 tenth diameter of the model. The viscosity of the model is 1.5 make an equality for water as fresh water and prototype we don't have information about velocity and we have diameter and also the viscosity which is We can obtain VP equals to meter on second. For drag force, we have a relation the coefficient of drag is CD equals to F on the row v2 l2 in this case we have this relation for model for example cf m equals to the we have the force for model density
So we can obtain the track force of the model equals to the 5.40. From similarity, we have the relation, the drag force of each model and prototype as equal. So CF prototype equals to So we can make a relation for the prototype FD row which for water and the velocity or uh, computed before multiply to the diameters. on diameter s fd can be calculated and is newtons Assuming we modeled the Reynolds number correctly, the model test is a very good idea as it would obviously be difficult to measure such a teeny Cooper drag force.